bad food, a family in ruins, and unsanitary conditions. You should kill somebody. It's been quite a first day. And as dinner service ends, Thank you. Chef Ramsay realizes that Sushiko is in much worse shape than he thought. Right. How is that for you? I think our kitchen could have run a little smoother. I don't think you're taking it seriously enough. The rice, the soup, the fridge, the broccoli. Talk to me. I think that Akira, you know, could do a lot more. There's so many bad practices, and you don't seem to give a fuck. Have you given up? I think he's given up. How many of your customers would order kushiyaki if they knew they were eating it or feeling it off a wooden stick that had been used three weeks ago? None of them. It's almost like you're a man in denial. Anything to say or? No, I should. He doesn't know how to fix it, though. He opened this place on the assumption that he was the delegator. He's lost. I think that the restaurants burnt him out. He thought that we were going to be living la vida loca. And when the business didn't go the way it was supposed to, he didn't know what to do. Obviously. But you don't really think that you're lazy, right? You think you work, do you think you work really hard all the time? I said, I think you should go cook. You go to not want to cook anymore. That's the way Akira feels. If, if I can pay you to do it, why should I do it? But you're not really paying them. Your kids are paying them. He doesn't know how to get off of his little skinny ass and really getting to work. Right. I, want you, I, I, I need you to shut up for two minutes, and I need you to talk. This is part of the reason why you've lost your voice. Not only is your wife wearing the trousers, but she's speaking for you. What is it? Talk to me. Come on. Talk to me. I just, uh, I don't know. Come on, Akira. Fuck me. Basically, I don't know what to do. I'm angry that Akira's lost his ability to communicate with people, and it was good to get it out. Akira, once a proud chef, has lost his way. And unfortunately, his family is being dragged down with him. Chef Ramsay knows that in order for this restaurant to have any chance of surviving, he must find a way to bring them together.